What's the astronomy right now of the U.S. dollar, given everything he's talking about? Yeah, I think that the dollar's not so much affected by these geopolitics, by U.S. foreign policy, but per se. it's a state. confidence issue. I think it's a confidence issue. I think there are plays to this idea that the U.S. is, uh, I think many people think it moving towards an isolationist, not only in politics, but also in economics. And I really don't see it as isolationist, more unilateralist. The U.S. wants to have that freedom to act without the confines of having to... A, a, Greet with the G7 or the G20 or the IMF or the Paris Accord. Does that risk our seniors? Does that risk our dominant currency? I think the biggest risk to it is the consistent, uh, throughout different administrations, of weaponizing uh, what used to be a public good, that is dollar funding, access to the deepest, broadest capital market in the world. This used to be a public good, a utility given to everybody. And increasingly, the U.S. is using it as a weapon to punish our enemies and reward our friends. Um, when do you see, uh, Mark, when you look at, uh, you know, the, the possible downturn in the world economy, where do you see it first? Do you see it in dollar? Do you see it in treasuries? Yeah, so that's interesting today. You know, with treasuries above 180 on the yield on the 10-year, last month we peaked at 190. Many people think that the bond yields are bottoming out. You know, I was looking at the German Bund this morning. Uh, we bottomed there at minus 72 basis points. Today we're at like minus 35 or so. So many people are thinking that the bond market's turning. I'm not in that camp. I think that we do get this global economic slowdown. And I think I agree with uh, uh, your previ previous guest, Reed from Deutsche Bank, talking about three more cuts in the coming months. We get a cut this week and maybe two cuts wow. in the first half of next serious? year. Really? I think the economy is rolling over. Extraordinary. I, I mean, Marty, what does our economics team say? I mean, the consensus there is one yeah, or they two cuts. Yeah, you know, slightly more than 25% chance of a recession in the U.S. in the 12 months. And you're bigger forward. than that, Mr. Chairman? I don't know about more of a recession. I do think that the economic slows down. And, well the, said, yeah. and the Federal Reserve makes this trade-off between low inflation and trying to extend this expansion.